Greetings and welcome to the uh, range here at the Scottish Open, the Aberdeen Standard Investments Scottish Open for 2018. And uh, here we are on a Tuesday, it's beautiful. We're at Gullen, which hosted this championship just a couple of years ago. Let's have a quick look around and see what's happening. A little bit of coaching gone over here. There's Patrick Harrington. From the hills for the and looks like Nacho Elvira down there. Darren Clark here. And they're all just getting their games together. And why not? That's what they do for a living. So something that happened to me last week at the Irish Open was that I got fitted. For clubs. I've had it done before but it's been a while since I've had it done actually and uh, choose some new bats. So while the clubs are being sorted out actually what I am going to collect today are the wedges and it's a nice time to actually give you a little bit of insight into something that fascinates fans and you know those who are interested in behind the scenes certainly when it comes to the equipment trucks and they're all over here so they're all lined up I'll just give you a quick look actually here. look at this all the different manufacturers and all catering for the players in the first couple of days of the tournament but good friends and Titus had a fitting center down the left of the range of the Irish Open in Ballyleffin. And here we are inside the belly of the beast. There's Henry Byrne. We talked to Henry in Italy a couple of weeks ago. All the hardworking people of Titleist and Footjoy. There's Guy Smith. Big wave from Guy. That's very important. But here it's like Star Trek. Watch this. Oh, yes. And inside is the main man, Carl. Carl, what do we got down here? Some custom fit wedges here for you. Okay, so you were given the spec by the boys who uh, fitted me. Yep. In uh, Ballyliffin last week. We were. So, so what we've got? You've got um, in the chalk grind finish. You've got a 5008 with the F grind. Yeah. And then you've got a 5410 with the S. Lovely. And then the low bounce 5804 with the L grind. Okay. So, so we're going to stand these up, yeah? We're going to personalise them up. Yeah, this is one of the great things that's an offer through Titleist is uh, their association with Wedgeworks. So if you want to personalise your wedges, mm -hmm. we see all the tour pros doing this. Yep. And they look cool and they're very much, you know, uh, related to their lives or their yep. favourite football team yeah, or their kids stuff, or whatever, whatever like that. Yeah, football yeah. teams, all that sort of stuff, yeah. Just personalise so, it up. So uh, one thing that uh, I like to promote with regard to me is my love of Tipperary. <laughs> So we're going to keep that theme going. Okay. I've had shoes done. I've had uh, putters. So let's get started. So we're going to go with up tip, all right? We are going up tip. Okay. We are, Carl. Right. How do you do this? And it's you. You do this. Okay. Yes. Yeah, we're just going to hit it with a hammer. That's basically pretty simple. Wow. So that's the U. Okay. Up. 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 There you go. <laughs> Who else is here working with you? We got Matthias over here. Who I've met. Hello. Yeah. How are you, Matthias? What are you doing? I'm entering an order for a uh, fitting tomorrow with the new fairway wood for Rafa Cabrera Bale. Okay. So new fairway wood for him. Yes. We're going to try it tomorrow and see how it performs. Okay. And how often do these guys chop and change or test out things? With Rafa, uh, maybe once a year, to be honest. He right. changes anything. Okay. But he's been a Titleist guy for a long time, correct? He has been a Titleist guy for many, many years. And um, this time it's the new TS Fairway Woods. We're going to enter some shafts and try um, the new heads tomorrow. All right, cool. Who else have we got here, Carl? So we've got Ian behind us here doing some wedges Why from Robert Carlson. Pretty special wedges, all one length they are. Oh right, this is a bit of a Bryson DeChambeau going yeah, on. Yeah, well, this is sort of fun. Robert has his wedges pretty long, so all through the, the three wedges he has are all at 37 inches. Yeah. So there's a bit of work that's involved in that to grind them down to swing weight. As you, as you go to the, the higher loft, they get pretty heavy, so actually quite a lot of work in grinding wow. them down. So. okay. 
so okay. he's a very tall man he is a very tall man yeah but six five nearly tip. six six and here we have up tip now the only thing missing are the colors carl okay so we're gonna go blue first or yellow first um let's go with blue first yellow so pretty oh. simple just pop the paint on there that'll dry out yeah Wow. I can't wait quick, for this. Give this a quick blast to dry it off. Gee. That was hot stuff, Carl. Hot stuff. <laughs> so you, people can go and get this done themselves. Yeah, we do this in the, in the, um, the, the, the workshop in the, in the offices there. So get the same sort of service. It's over there. I love it. I love it. There you go. All right, we're going to get the others done as well, and a few different things on them. I'm actually, I might actually pause with regard to the third one. I think the second one is just going to have my name on them. The third one, I'll probably put my kids' names on. This is going to have Shano on it. So Shano, yeah, next. This is where it's all happening. Maybe in the tightless truck. Okay. And there's Tong Chai Jai D. Yeah. Okay. There he is. I watched you win in Korea a few years ago. Uh, thanks, man. The Ballantines, am I right? Long time. Jeju Island. That's it, I was there. All right, Carl is doing that. But you can go online and just check out Wedgeworks, courtesy of our friends in Tightlist.